if you don't love what you are doing, you will always have problem. Even if it is the most wonderful job. So start loving what God has given you. Always try to find positiveness in everything in your life. Because positivity, that's what we should stand upon. If you are positive, you will attract positive to your life. And if you are negative, that will come to you. So, try your best to be in that state. Yo, 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 what up YouTube? Welcome to CN Tech, man. My name is Jay Sin, coming back with another one, man. And I wanted y'all to see that clip, man, because sometimes it's just that simple. Sometimes it really is just that simple, man. You just gotta love what the fuck you do and appreciate what the Most High has given you. Real talk, you know what I'm saying? If you do that, you won't have no problems. If you do that, you won't have no problems, you know what I mean? You got a lot of people that don't love a lot of things that they have. They don't love the opportunities that they have. They don't love the job that they have. They don't love the life that they have. They don't love the family that they have. Like, listen, bruh, listen. You gotta appreciate the things that you have. You know what I mean? You gotta appreciate it because a lot of times people don't have even half of what you got. You know what I'm saying? And when you love something, right, it makes it easier. You know what I'm saying? You gotta love to be on this journey. You know what I'm saying? If you love this journey, bro, listen, man, it ain't gonna be nothing to you. You know what I'm saying? And I don't mean like it's not gonna be nothing to you, like you ain't go like it ain't gonna mean nothing to you. I mean it's just gonna it's gonna become an everyday thing for you. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna become a way of life. You know what I'm saying? Because you love this. You wake up for this. You breathe this. You smell this. You know what I mean? You live this. But if you don't love it, bro, then guess what you're gonna do? You already know. You're gonna keep relapsing, bro. You're gonna keep relapsing. You're gonna, you know, you, you, you gonna, you gonna fall every time you have a flat line. Your flat line is gonna be eating you up. You know what I mean? It's just gonna be like it's gonna be like you're not on anything. You ain't even on the journey. You know what I'm saying? Because you don't you don't love it like you should. You know what I mean? You're not seeing how it's shaping you up. Yeah, so that could go for anything. No fat, your weight loss journey, you gotta love to go to the gym. You gotta love the idea of you losing weight and actually putting in work to do it. You know what I mean? You gotta love to eat right. You know what I'm saying? Like all of that shit, man. You gotta you gotta really do love. What it is you do it. You know what I'm saying? If you don't love it, bruh, it ain't gonna last long. Or you just gonna be miserable inside of it. And when you miserable and you don't love something, you're gonna fail at it. You're gonna fail at it. So I want y'all to remember that, man. I'm not telling you that you need to be overjoyed by anything, but find, find the things that you like, find the things that you love inside of what you do. You know what I'm saying? Even if you don't like your job like that, you know what? You know, find find a reason besides money. To still get up and make it to that motherfucker You know what I'm saying Whether it's the friends or the people that you see and talk to there Whatever the case may be You know what I mean But appreciate what you have man Appreciate what, what the most high has provided you with Instead of being all Instead of complaining all the time Man the ones that always got a problem Listen bro ain't nothing ever right for them You know what I'm saying Because they always got an issue with something They complain about everything you know what I'm saying? And the people that do that, they always going to have problems. Just like he said in that clip. You're going to have a problem with everything. And if you don't have an actual problem with it, you will find one. Y'all ever known people like that? They look for the bad and shit. They don't never, they don't never think positive. You know, everything got to be negative. They can get a new car, but they going to find something wrong with it right away. You know what I'm saying? They going to find issues with it. You know what I mean? When it's damn bet when it's way better than the last piece of shit that they had. You know what I'm saying? They get they get some new clothes, they gonna find a little a little string hanging from it and they gonna be mad about that. When all you gotta do is just burn that motherfucker off. They go get a haircut, they gonna find something wrong with that. Ah, I could've did this, could've did that. You know what I'm saying? But didn't say nothing while you was there. You know what I mean? Anything, anything. They go to work, they gonna find a million things to complain about. You know what I'm saying? But 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 the but the job putting the roof over their head is paying the bills. You know what I mean? It's keeping them with the necessities that they need. You know what I mean? It's up to you to take it to the next level, whether it's in your job or outside of that. 
You know what I mean? The power is in our hands. And that's what people got to understand, man. Like I said in that video, man, we could change our reality, bro. It's all about how you manipulate energy and how positive you are. You know how focused you are. But if you ain't focused or, or positive and all you do is focus on the negative, bro. Listen, bro, that's that's unproductive. You ain't going to never have nothing. You're going to always find a problem in anything. And nothing will ever get solved in your life. You will never find happiness. You know, and a lot of times, man, us men, we end up in relationships with bitches like this. You know what I mean? She ain't never happy. She always complaining. Her whole world is always coming to an end when the smallest situations happen. That's why I said the other day, you cannot be emotional. You, you, can't, you can't be there emotionally for your girl like that. You got to let her go through shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? And that shit is real. Because some people you just gonna have, they just gonna find the problems, bro. They gonna, they gonna look at it. And you got a lot of, and, and not just women, you got a lot of dudes too. You know, they just find that because they don't have no other way to feel. And they like to live in that emotion. You know what I'm saying? Because they can't feel anything else. They don't want to. They don't know what it's, they don't want to know. They don't want to be happy, bro. Some people just don't want to be happy. They feel better when they upset. They feel better when they mad. You know what I'm saying? The only way they know how to express themselves is through anger. It's through anger. And I suggest you get away from people like that, bro. They gonna let they gonna get you in trouble. They gonna fuck your whole spirit up. They gonna have you vibrating low, your energy low. Because you always dealing with their situations. You always gotta be around. They gonna always fuck up a good time. Always fuck up a good time. They always gonna have problems, man. So you can't be like that. You can't be like that. Love what the fuck you do, man. Everything that you're doing right now, bro, listen, man. You're doing it for a reason. You know, it found you for a reason. The most high sought you out for this task, for this journey. You know what I'm saying? He wanted you to have this opportunity. The most high wanted you to have this. You know what I'm saying? So you got to learn how to love this way of life, bro. This, this, this way of life. Don't that, that feel good to say that? Nigga, this way of life, bro, this is a way of life. It's almost like we found a new beginning, a new way of living that everybody ain't on. You know what I'm saying? And, then, and that's just like, yo, man, it, it, man, I can't express how good it feels, bro. I can't. I really can't. You know what I'm saying? Because, man, we could be going in the wrong direction right now. We could still be distracted right now. But we still we still doing this, man. We doing this and trying to do better with our lives, man. What more can you ask for? Why not? Why not love this? You know what I'm saying? If you don't love it, then you probably, you is nine times out of ten, you don't belong here. You know what I'm saying? You don't belong in this type of community, man. If you don't love anything that you're doing, you may as well not even do it. If your heart ain't in it. If your body ain't in it, if your soul ain't in it, then what you doing it for? Don't even do it. Don't even waste your time. Don't waste the most high's time. You know what I mean? While he, while the most high trying to put you on game. You know what I mean? So listen, man, embrace everything that you do, man, with love and positivity, man. That's how you gonna excel, bro. That's how you gonna level up. That's how you gonna have these thoughts formulating that's gonna keep you, that's gonna keep you grounded, but also keep you ahead. You know what I mean? It's gonna keep you ahead. Everybody else gonna be stuck in their emotions and feeling down about what the fuck it is they do. That's why you can't get mad at people that love what they do, no matter how you look at it. I said this before. You can't get mad at people. Some people love their job at McDonald's, bro. I salute them. If, they, if, if some people love, some people love landscaping, bro. I salute them. They love their job. They take pride in that shit. That's why that shit be looking good like that. That's how they be having the lines all cut in the grass. The shit, you know, trimmed up on the edges and all of that. They love what they do. Respect people that love what they do. You need to get up on game. You need to start loving what it is that you do, whatever that is. If you ain't found your purpose, start looking for it. Something, find something that you love doing and stick with it. That's the that's damn near like the key to success right there. You know what I'm saying? That's the key to success, man. So with anything that you do, bruh, like try to find the positive in it. You know what I mean? Love yourself at the same time. Because if you don't love yourself, you're not gonna love nothing else, man. 
If you don't love yourself, you're not going to love anything else or anyone else. So, with that being said, man, have a good day. Peace. First, I'ma get on my grind. Then, second, stop wasting my time. Oh shit, less important. If ain't about money, I'm going the other direction. And third, I'ma do what I gotta to eat. Fourth, I'ma sew up the streets. Fifth, I'ma never quit dropping this heat. So, as long as I'm breathing, you better get used to me. Sixth, I'ma get.